Hey everybody, welcome back to World of Final Fantasy. I'm gonna get straight into it and just talk to this girl who don't remember her name, but she's always in this tea room just being like, yo, intervention quest. Um, we got the Pleiades or Pleiades or whatever, it doesn't really matter. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna pick up my reward. I got that memento, it's gonna be useful. I can turn the Krampus into that. I got him anyways. Uh, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah. Leviathan. Avenging your ancestors. Leviathan. F that. I'm going against the butcher because this one looks a lot more interesting. Let's, uh, let's do this one. Also, I may have prepared and it's a bit tougher, this one. This should be the place I heard about. Traveler, test your strength. So there you are. The Butcher. You've heard a lot of people. They call me a Butcher? Rubbish. I merely challenge fools who would be challenged and they die. Then you're not very sporting. Every one of your victims was cut down without a fight. He who lives by the sword must be quick to draw it. Truly, they met with no foul play. If they expired without a struggle, that attests to their dearth of skill and not my lack of honor. Mm. It is a troubling thought to be gone less than a century and return to find swordsmanship so diminished. Troubling indeed. How poetic. If it's a challenge you're looking for, why don't you see how you and your principles fare against me? Ah, uh, your spirit is impressive. Let us begin. Mm -hmm. What? Sorry, dude. There's been a change in the lineup. You really ought to know better than to butcher people. I remember you. To fight again after so long would be a thrill. But you catch me as my blood quickens for another. My first worthy foe in ages. This trickery. This space in which you have confined me. I'll not be detained. What is... Lon! Get out of that thing's way! Aw, oh, dude! Zan. Tits. Ken. <laughs> oh, missed by a hair. <laughs> Good. You're the strongest warrior I've crossed swords with in years. And yet, twould be poor form to pursue this now. Find a new blade, and we shall continue this test of our might. <sighs> Looks like this won't be as easy as I thought. Does he have a weakness? You're taking on Odin? Yeah. I heard that you have experience with the Dyad servants. Basically. Anything you can tell me would be a big help. Odin? Hmm... Oh, got it. It's just an old rumor, but... At last. You would try me with the same sword that failed you before? Yeah. Except, I thought I'd mix things up. Girl, she looks like Ramuz. It's his grandkid. Grandkid! Hmm. I see you've been sniffing about. Is is this the best you can muster? Yep. What's wrong? Suddenly you don't look so hot. Hmm. Silence. Make your peace before I cleave you in twain.
What do we have here? Is Odin <gasps> afraid of a weed whitening? Hey, that reminds me. Wasn't Old Ramu the only one you never had the guts to go head to head with? Whoa! Dude, 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 is that true? What I. I come up before no one. Yeah, because his name is Odin. Uh, but I digress. Everybody, you know this guy's weakness? Because let me tell you something, the cutscene really showcased it. But in case you haven't guessed it, because, I mean, I'm pretty dense myself. But it helps to just have it on screen. Lightning, everybody. He has a super weakness against lightning. Throw that shit at him. You have Ramu? You have Ramu? His grandkid? You know, bring them out. Personally, I, I can't because, you know, I never really bothered with that shit, but, uh, yeah, that's basically what you got going on here. You know, Odin, he's got the star next to his name, so he's pretty damn important to some degree. I don't really know. These, these Pleiad whatevers don't use status resistance. Just throw lightning at him. If you've brought the spells, great. I'm gonna save all my AP for Kiraga, but, you know, I'm, I'm just saying this is what we got going on here. Now then, all that explained, uh, I'm doing this live because I sort of may have prepared just a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean, have a lightning marble. I don't have any lightning spell stones. I, I must have used them all up. That is very unfortunate for this situation. That said, I did happen to bring out some champions. I got lightning, squall, and I have Yuna. Yuna, very important. One star cost. It'll become really important later on. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna take this back straight up Final Fantasy VIII style. If I had Cypher here, I would totally bring him out because he's the Odin Slayer. It's a very, very awesome scene in Final Fantasy VIII. Here I am. I'll take it from here. as much damage as I wanted it to do, but all the same, still still not too bad. I, I may have should have gone with lightning. Just just a thought. In hindsight, it might have been the better alternative. Also, lightning happens to have somewhat of a thing with Odin. Because, I mean, that, like, uh, let's see, that's right. Or whatever. I don't know. She could summon Odin. That was that was like her special summon thing in that game. In Final Fantasy 13. I happen to know that because I had the unfortunate liberty of actually playing 13. I uh, could have spent my time doing other things, but I digress. Point is, if nothing else, just keep throwing lightning items at him. I'm save all my AP for healing, as I said before. Oh, this is Lon's deck. His little stack. That's okay. There we go. Now I'm gonna use the Kiraga. There we go. That's looking a little bit better. Now we're all good. He can keep on hitting us. Worst case scenario, he's gonna he's gonna use one of his special abilities. They're not fun. As if you know anything about Final Fantasy, you got Odin. He uses one of two attacks when you summon him. One is a. Uh, Average damaging attack, the other one... <laughs> you know what? You ought to be in the way when he uses it. It's not good. This might be one of those. It's not. He has other abilities. I'm, I'm not so impressed. Let's see. Eh, I, don't, I don't need to use that. I'm, I'm going to just keep on using my, my thunder items, lightning items. Technically, it's technically lightning. I don't know. I got the Pokemon on the brain where I mix up lightning and thunder. Not doing so hot though. Not even using any special. He's he's storing them. You know, and it's just by bite, biting some time. Uh, speaking of which, I need to heal up just a little bit. So I may sound a little frantic doing this live because it's not too difficult, but it can be. Uh, it can be haphazardous depending on how you go about it but all the same I should be able to get through this and we we can move on to the last the last little thing that we got going on 
Ops Leviathan. I'll save all my comments till then. But in the meantime, Odin, everybody. Kind of reminds me of, uh, I want to say Final Fantasy IX. Like, his depiction looks very much like Final Fantasy IX. Although, could be mixing that up with Seven, because I think those two were very close. No, it doesn't look like his depiction in Final Fantasy VIII. He had a little more facial features, mainly in the nose region, but I digress. It's Odin, everybody. He looks pretty cool if you ask me. Also, if you have any lightning spell stones, I highly recommend you use them. They do a shit ton of damage. I mean, I'm using basically the uh, Thundra item form, and it's doing a pretty good amount of damage. And of course, I could have run... Oh, he, he didn't even use any of his special abilities. Okay, he actually does have Zen Tetsuken or whatever. I completely forgot the, one, the move that he used in the cutscene. He actually has that, and it's pretty much going to instant kill or do a shit ton of damage. If you have the ability last stand, which Tesshire happens to have... Uh, it's it's a good saving grace. He also has Gungnir where he takes out his spear and hits everybody for a good load of damage. I just happen to not show any of that. It's bizarrely weird. I just I got through that without him actually showing off anything. Well, that was that. Good. This shall forever stand as proof that your skill surpasses mine. I'm pleased to have met so fierce a warrior. Ours was a duel to remember. Huh. That's for sure. But it was a close one. At least, no more travelers will get shorn in two. Ramul, I owe you one. Ramul! Owen. Oh, I guess I owe Lon and Rain a thank you as well, wherever they are. Now then. Well, I, I'm, I'm sort of, I'm sort of let down. I was thinking it was going to do some pretty impressive stuff. Then Tetsuken. I, I thought he was going to at least throw that out. That was, he just decided to give me that win. Uh, you can stay with Seraphie because I I'm not using you. I mean I would may use you in the in the in the bonus dungeon later on because I gotta show off a lot of things I haven't. No holds barred in that. Uh, I know it's been an early part, but I mean last one in the next part. I, I'm not, no, you can't wait. It's gonna be amazing. Leviathan's gonna come out of the water and be like, "Hi, I'm Leviathan." Better get your water resistance, maybe even stockpile more lightning items, I don't really know at this point.